Okay, so apparently it's come to my attention that I need to address some of you guys about as to what had actually happened on um, Saturday night when I had my second my second ever pro boxing match against Josh Bruckner. Um, you know, I'm going to start this off by saying I give numerous credit and merit and flowers, all that to Josh. I think he's an outstanding athlete, an outstanding fighter. And a lot of you guys who watch these press conferences and watch these um, weigh-ins and all that need to understand that most of this stuff is about um, selling this fight, getting you guys to be more invested. Um, me personally, I've never had an issue with Josh or his girlfriend. I actually think they're very nice people. I like what they are doing on their channel. Um, a lot of you guys are mad because I said, you know, I brought my team. He brought his girlfriend. It's trash talk. It's hype. It's built for the media, guys. Like, honestly, the first time I met the guy, I said hi to him. He's honestly a, a good dude. I have no quarrels against him. Secondly, talking about the fight. If you guys watch some of these clips that I'm putting down below, this is the first round. I'm going toe to toe with this guy, Josh. This is my second ever boxing match, like ever. The first one was Corey. Um, Corey's a cool dude too, but like I didn't learn anything from the Corey match because you know he didn't know how to fight. I didn't know how to fight really. So you know I went in there and I beat the snot out of Corey, and that is what it is for that. So the second match, you know I do mostly the same thing. I go in there, and as you can see in these clips, me and him, we're going back and forth. Um, we're going toe to toe, um, and you know eventually, obviously, I'm a lot bigger than him. Um, he knows how to pace himself in a fight. He's done this numerous times. I don't. Um, I'm used to, you know, just street fights, get it done over with. And so after I start getting tired, you know, we're going back and forth. I'm getting my timing between these rounds. Um, you know, this shot right here to the back of the head, I don't care how big you are, strong you are, this right here. To the second round, the problem here is if you're Chase, you, just, you can't defend yourself at all. Right, so he's it, it, looking for any way. Uh, here we go. Uh, my lights went off for a second and then came back on. There's nothing back here guarding that. So, you know, a mix between that shot, being tired, I was sitting in the corner, I'm telling my coaches, like, I'm good, I'm good, let me go back out. Um, they're saying, like, no, like, safety comes um, entirely first, especially in celebrity boxing, where this is just for entertainment. Um, you know, nobody's trying to kill anybody in the ring. So, like, all you guys in the comment sections they have nothing but negative things to say. Like, I'm not really worried about it. This is actually, you know, the last thing I'm going to address about this. I'm actually moving on from this. Um, you know, I'm getting ready for my next boxing match now. I'm focused on that. I'm selling that fight. I'm being ready for that. You know, I'm taking notes from this um, bout, you know getting my cardio up, understanding that like, I don't need as much muscle in this fighting scene as I did in street fights. And, you know, give obviously congrats to Josh on his championship and his belt and stuff like that. I think him and his girlfriend or his wife um, really deserve it. Um, you know, and, you know, I'm, you know, better luck next time. We'll get the match. Um, mad respect to Josh. Um, same with myself. Um, you know, nobody wanted to fight him because of his pro fighting background. And I said yes without a blink of an eye. So if anybody has anything to say about that any further, um, you know, I'm done responding to the hate comments and, and the hate tweets and all of that. I'm going to be personally back in the ring better than ever. Same old Chase, starting up the internet. Um, and if you guys don't like it, I'm sorry about it. But yeah, this is what I do. This is what I have fun doing and I enjoy my work. So all I can say is happy Monday to you guys. I hope you guys have a great um, week. Um, happy holidays, and I'll be seeing you guys soon. Much love, Chase up.